I love snow. John Snow. Enter here. That's a text from Jesus saying you need to calm down. Your nipples are gonna look like mozzarella sticks. When I mean into it, I mean your asshole. I've just never looked better in my entire life. I'm doing freaking fantastic. How are you guys doing? Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be doing a Fashion Nova haul, which I think I'm gonna be most excited about this particular Fashion Nova haul than all the other ones that I've done in the past for the main reason that today's video, I'm not wearing a bra, so if you see me like trying to cover myself up, that's why, is because I am going to go meet Cardi B today. By the time you guys see this video, Cardi B's second collection will have already launched. Check it out in the description. I literally don't know why I'm like promoting this shit out of Cardi B. She doesn't need promotion and I'm not getting paid for this, but I freaking love her. And I'm gonna go meet her tonight. I cannot believe Fashion Nova invited me out. I'm gonna see her. Will she see me? Probably not. But what is the chance that she'll look out into the ocean of people, the sea of Instagram models, and she'll make eye contact with the tiny little Asian girl in the right corner? Like, what are the chances of that? And if that does happen, I need to make sure I look on flick bits. I need to look like literally ice cream money, shmoney, okra, like bodak yellow bits. But today, I have an entire haul of things. I worked so hard in picking these clothes out because I was like, no, I know I'm going to wear one of these to go see Cardi B. So I'm just going to jump right into it, guys. So this is actually the first piece that I have. I'm like so attracted. So this is the first piece that I chose. And when I saw it on the website, it's called Gingham goddess two-piece set and I didn't know gingham was actually like the name of this pattern like this picnic table pattern I literally thought it was called picnic table pattern but it has a name it's gingham and I straight up thought it said Gangnam goddess like the town in Seoul so I was like oh Gangnam goddess like I'm a freaking Korean kimchi asshole let me get this we're gonna try it on I love the buttons love this vibe let me just like insta ho it up for a second nobody's even taking a picture of me and I'm like let me insta ho and I really hate tooting my own horn but toot toot biz I feel like this outfit is so cute I am a little bit pale right now maybe I'll get a spray tan leave it in the comments have you ever gotten one that'll be my first time I don't know if I should even do it this two-piece right here I'm gonna literally keep looking into the viewfinder and this mirror right now because it cinches you up I do wish like being a little bit of a nitpicky asshole that I am I do wish like the waist was a little bit tighter because I could use a little bit more like someone could easily just slip their number in my pocket the material is really nice it's really soft I don't see my panty line in the back. I'm so glad that I have this mirror here. This is such a good setup. But I don't see like my panty color in the back. Like it's not see-through, but it's it's breathable. It's like a good summer material. I saw this on a tutorial the other day. <laughs> That's a text from Jesus saying you need to calm down. <laughs> I saw a tutorial on how to contour abs. <gasps> I have to show my fiance. He said, whoa. I think I'm going to catfish the world. Who cares about Facetune? All you need is a contour stick in this two-piece outfit. I think contouring my abs will become a daily thing. Swipe up for your own nutrition guide. Ooh. Okay, so the next thing I got, I've already tried this one on. And this one is the cutest little yellow dress that I've ever tried on. You know how if you go to like a really nice fruit place or any Asian food market and they have produce and you get those Fiji apples, those Fuji apples, or those Asian pears and they come in like that plastic slinky sleeves. That's what this feels like. And this used to be in when I was in high school and I loved it. This video is Stephanie Sue essing her own D for 20 minutes straight. Before I started filming this haul, I legitimately had two slices of croissant toast. But this dress makes me look like a skinny legend who doesn't even know what a carb is. I like the part that the sleeves are connected, but they're not restrictive. I can still move my arms around. I love these ruffles at the end. This is my new best friend. Who cares about Patricia when I got this yellow dress that makes my butt look a little bit bigger? I'm <laughs> just kidding, Patricia, don't kill me. Do I want Cardi B to like look out and see me and be like, oh my god, Bodak yellow? Or do we like the pink? I like this one. This is a strong contender. <laughs> my mom is not gonna be excited to watch this video. Mom, if you're watching this, I apologize. I will cleanse my sins tonight. Yesterday, I had actually attempted to film this video yesterday, and Fashion Nova did not pay me to say this. Literally, I think they might actually be upset. But this is a bikini top so these pants are actually fashion nova but they were from my last haul but this top is actually part of this high-waisted super neon bikini fashion nova they really went into it and when i mean into it i mean your asshole this was literally up my butt my butt cheeks look ginormous when i was trying it on my fiance walked in on me and we stopped filming because we started filming <laughs> that's the truth 
you got to honest reason why I stopped filming the video yesterday and I have to refilm it all today. Like this top is so cute that I would mainly wear it like this. It's such a cute summertime vibe. I will say this though, I am wearing a bra underneath to push up my boobs, but also the fact that like your nipples are gonna look like mozzarella sticks. It's not that thick of a fabric, so if you don't mind some nippleage, this is perfect for you. But size up, okay? Size up if you're gonna get the bikini bottoms because they are just they are up your ass. I mean, in a good way, but also not in a good way. You're in Vegas, sized, sized down, bitch. But if you're at home and you're going to the community pool, and David, your neighbor, is barbecuing over there with his 12 kids, then like maybe it's not the best idea. Maybe you should size up. But I love the fact that the, the bottoms, they came up all the way to the stomach, covered the belly button, and your waist looks so snatched. But I'm not gonna show you because I'm really trying to stay monetized. So this is the next piece that I got. And you guys have already seen this because I've Instagram storied this so many times. But this is the same like <laughs> Why did I want to say consistency? It is the same like type of fabric as the yellow one, wherever that went, where it's like that stretchy material. It kind of feels like a slinky, and I'm obsessed with this. Like this also makes me look like I don't know what a toast is. I've never heard of her. The ruffles at the bottom, I really do think they make your like butt look a little bit more poppin' than usual. Everyone's like, what are you shaking? There's no salt in that salt shaker. And let me try, I don't know if this will actually even look cute together. I think I have a couple of shoes from Fashion Nova so far, and they've always been super comfortable but these are kind of like your white boots like these are not <laughs> the white boots that I had intended to get nor are they one that the ones that I was looking for for a really long time but I'm gonna try these on I love the bejeweled I feel like it kind of like makes it a little bit more festive because everybody and their mother is wearing white booties right now just looking at it from the side while they're on my legs <gasps> I like them. They are a little bit loose, so maybe size down a little bit, maybe like half a size or even a full size, depending. I like the heel is not super thin. Like, I feel like anytime you have a super thin heel, it just looks like you're doing the most. I kind of like it with the dress. I feel like it makes it look like, you know what this reminds me of? What's that character in Scooby-Doo? The cute one that always wears the white boots. I just think this makes you look so proportionate. Like the white boots actually make your legs look longer even though they cut it. I actually like the dress more now that I put it on with the boots. Say actually one more time, sis. In reality, I think I will wear it together. Probably not tonight. This is more of like your daytime cute brunch vibes and less of like a dinner, like party, like bodak yellow vibes. Did you see the reflection in the Okay, sorry. Next job. I have been dying to try this. This is like one of my most exciting pieces in this haul, and I hope it looks good on. It's a lavender striped jacket, and I'm realizing that with this dress, I look like I need help. Just look at what I'm wearing on the outside. Literally, I look fun and fresh, guys. I feel like I'm the only person that's gonna love this. Well, actually, no, I think it was on their popular list. I'm not entirely sure, but I love this one. It's not super heavy. Like, I think I have a problem with denim jackets in the summer because they get super sweaty. Like, you're trying to be cute, and then the entire day, you're just wearing your denim jacket like this, not because it's a fashion statement, but because your pits are sweaty. This is more of like an actual light summer. I'm gonna later on pair this with something that's not super colorful on the inside but so far so good look at my butt that's a sentence i never thought i would scream i have been having like a few little moments of just insecurity recently since i got back from korea that's a long story i think i'm doing a girl talk on that but i don't really have like a figure that is 2019 friendly it's not the type that like, everyone's gonna click that double tap no one's trying to double tap my ass pics on instagram but this outfit makes me look like I have a figure. I don't even know what's going on. This is really tight, but it just kind of helps bump out the booty a little bit. I love the fact that the skirt goes on high and it's super tight around the waist in a good way so it suctions you up. You get a little bit of like your contoured ab that you manufactured. This is made by Stephanie and Company, okay? This one's really cute and flirty. I also love like the details, like the straps on this. I know I'm wearing a strappy bra, so I promise I'll wear a strapless with this. It has got like the rough so it looks really cute. It matches the bottoms of this. I still really like the jacket. This next one, I mean, I feel like everything has been going too well right now, and I kind of like hauls where there's a few fails, so sometimes I self-sabotage in my own cart just so I can see some outfits that aren't going to be cute, and I think this is the one, sis. I think I'm going to try this one, and I'm going to say, hey, Fashion Nova, everything nice I said about you? Well, look at this one, okay? It's another two-piece. I don't know why I'm so into two-pieces, and I think they call it like the hologram two-piece, and I mean, this just... This looks like it's not gonna do anything nice for my body, but we're gonna try it on. He just said my outfit is dope. 
I mean, it's not my favorite, but it's actually not bad. I feel like this is a Tokyo moment, you know? You go to Tokyo, you're in the busy streets, you're about to get hit over by a cab, all the pedestrians are around you, like freaking Americans, right? And you're all just like, oh my god, like, when in Tokyo? With a puffer jacket! Like, people always post those Instagrams where they're wearing, like, this. some people wear literally bikinis and then they'll put on those giant puffer jackets. And they're like, I love snow. Jon Snow, enter here. Okay, sorry, he's married. Speaking of Tokyo type of vibes for Instagram, let me try this piece on. It's neon, it's green. I think I could even try to put it on on top of this and make it a look. Hold on. Never mind, it's a complete full dress. It is not a jacket. I thought it was gonna be a jacket dress, but I'm just gonna go try this one on because I'm kind of excited about this one too. This is not the typical vibe that I go for. On your mark, get ready, set, go! <laughs> I don't know why I love everything. This has been probably the most successful haul that I've ever had. Love the neon color, super comfortable, cinches naturally here. The zipper, I mean, you could go down as low as you want, you know? Like if you really wanted, you could just you could just go all the way. But we're trying to be conservative. Here. With your hair tied, this is really like Tokyo vibes. You could definitely do some sneakers with this. You could even do those white boots with this. Next piece I'm so excited about because they have this also in a really beautiful like sea foam, super pastel green color. And I was debating between this pink color and the green killer, the green killer, the green color, and obviously I have the pink one. And it fits nice. I'm about to order every single thing that I liked inside that bathroom that I just tried on for you guys in any other color that they sell it because those were so cute. I got this one mainly because the boob kind of has like that cowl structure which always makes my boobs look a lot bigger than they are. I'm a fan of catfishing people. You know? This one is um definitely probably the hoeiest one out of the bunch and I know that sounds crazy because all the other ones were two pieces. You could see my stomach. This one is very thin material. Like I can see my underwear line showing through the back. I love the color love everything about this it is definitely lower I just don't love it as much as I love everything else. From afar, it's cute, but it, it definitely be one of those pieces where I would not wear this out in public unless I had something tied around my waist. I mean, I guess we can try like really try to make this lavender work off the shoulder. I mean, that's cute. This is another bikini set that I got, and it's actually a three piece. Again, these are the shorts that I paired with the neon ones, but these come with these really nice, high waisted, super cute white bikini bottoms, which kind of are a tiny bit see through. So, with this white bikini top, even, this is a huge nipple moment. I love this cover up, it's striped. So I'm kind of concerned about the tan lines that you might be getting. But this one overall, I'm not a huge fan of because I know for a fact that I am not having a mozzarella stick moment anytime soon. And so I don't think that this is actually very practical for me. So before I change out of these shorts, I'm going to show you guys the last bikini that I got, which are these, again, high-waisted black bikini bottoms, which I'm so glad high-waisted bikini bottoms are back in because like that just makes it a lot better for me. That is good for the economy. That is good for my self-esteem. That is good for the burrito business this summer. I am very excited, okay? I love this bikini top. I don't think it's the most flattering. Like, I don't think it makes you look super feminine. I don't think it makes you look super busty. But I do think it's very athletic feeling. This feels like, yeah, she ain't got no boobs, but she could probably ride a wave. I'm trying to embrace my small boobs. Because she doesn't have big boobs, she could probably run fast. She's probably on the track team because nothing's weighing her down. I like this one. I still think the neon is my absolute, like, die-hard favorite. If you have to get any of these swimsuits, get the neon. You and everybody around you is going to thank me. You know what? I really wanted to love this. I really did. I mean, again, I do feel like it does kind of accentuate your waist. It does make you look a little bit like a skinny legend, but I just don't know how I feel about these arms. Like, from one perspective, when I look far away in my bathroom mirror, because my bathroom door is open, I'm like, you look good, sis. You look like a snatched lemon. You look like a snatched Valencia orange. But then when I look at the viewfinder really close, I'm like, I don't know about these arms. I just don't know. I don't know how I feel. I think it's because, like, this kind of flares out, but it's like on my elbow, not at the bottom. I do love this color. It does make you look skinnier, but it's just, it's a little bit see-through too. That's it for my haul bits. I definitely recommend getting the other yellow dress. This is probably one of my favorite hauls I've ever done. I hope that you guys aren't offended that I was feeling myself so 
so hard in this video it's just the fact that like i feel like i don't look good in a lot of things and i don't have like the perfect body shape for 2019 insta pics but i'm telling you if i look good in these you will look good in these so i'm gonna link them down below i'm gonna try to link them actually in like my most favorite my best pieces to like the my least favorite like oh so like if you guys have like the same sense of style like maybe you could just look at my first couple of links and you're like these are the ones sis but i'm actually gonna go order some of those in different colors that I already tried on because I really do like them. I hope you guys enjoyed today's haul. Leave it in the comments which one was your favorite outfit, which one do you not like, what's your favorite trend going on right now, what's your color that you're into, let me know in the comments. What other hauls do you want to see me haul, like what other brands, let me know in the comments. And I love you guys so, so much. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh.